morning, you guys. Hi, everybody. Welcome. Thank you guys for joining today. I'm going to hop right in. Today, I'm going to be talking about the three ways to help you feel unstuck in your playing. Before I get started, I do want to remind you that the free background music class is today. So if you have not already enrolled, this is your last chance. The link is in my bio on Instagram, or if you put a thumbs up on Facebook, I will respond with the link for you guys. It's all about how to play background music, um, how to know what chords to play, fills, things like that. Um, so make sure that you take part in that class today. And thank you guys for sharing that information and for spreading the word about the class. So let's get right into this. <clears throat> the three things that make you feel stuck. Um, for this, lesson I'm going to be using the song called to be and I'm just going to do it in C I think it is actually in C <clears throat> which is great okay so um, if you are not learning any new tricks that's going to make you feel stuck so I'm going to um, add one of the tricks that I have been working on. I have my little notepad here of tricks I'm working on. I keep it by the piano. So I'm going to see if I can add it to the song. So let's try this. So I will be what you call me to be. I'll say yes. doing so let's see Stuck. The second thing that will help you feel unstuck um, or will make you feel stuck is when you're not learning any new songs. So um, you may hear a song that's posted on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram that a church is doing and you're like, oh my goodness, I would love to do that song. For example, um, let's see, the song You Have Not Stopped by Anthony Brown. And so you're thinking, oh my goodness, I'd love to learn to play that song, but I can't find the chords. Here's what you do. You literally go to your computer right here, go to Google, and you type in, I'm going to tell you what I'm typing, you have not stopped chords, Anthony Brown. And let's see if it comes up. Oh, la, 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 la. Anthony Brown and Group Therapy, Trust in You Chords. Oh, that's not the right song. Does he, is he the one that does that song? Yes, you have not stopped. Okay. Um, okay, so in this case, I'm not finding the chords to this one, but 
There are chords to trust in you. The song, uh, let's see. You did not create me to worry. All you have to do is Google that title with his name and it's gonna pull up the chords right here. UltimateGuitarTabs.com. There's your chord chart for trust in you and you can learn to play the song, okay? So, like I said, there are some songs that are not available but there are a lot of songs that are. So make sure you're using your resource right here. Um, Google chord charts. So the name of the song, the title of the song, the artist, if you have it, and then if you type chord chart in, it will actually pull up the chords. So that is like a killer, wonderful tip. We use that all the time for songs that we're learning so I don't have to write out chord charts. Um, even though I can, uh, sometimes it can be time consuming to do that. So it's easy just to go and be able to grab the chords if you have those available. So the third thing, <clears throat> well, let's go back to the second thing. So once you are able to access those chords, then you can sit down and practice the song. And it's going to help you not feel stuck because you're learning a new song. You did not create me to worry. You did not create me to be. Practicing. It doesn't have to be an hour a day. It doesn't have to be 30 minutes a day. 15 minutes is a good amount of time for you guys to practice. So I would do something like this. Hey Google, set a timer for 15 minutes. 15 minutes and we're starting now. Okay. Speaking of timer, to make sure you're scrubbing up thoroughly, just say, sing while I wash my hands. Okay. She'll sing while you wash your hands. I did not know that. <laughs> Okay, so then you might practice, you might play a song you already know. So one song I like to sit down and play is, uh, chart of trust in you that you just found on Google and play through that song or you may try to play through a song that you're doing during service so let me see if I can pull up really quick our Sunday morning set list we actually have a conference this weekend so we are doing uh, Saturday morning we are doing thank you Lord so I would pull up the chord chart to that and just run through it really quick if I wanted to. Your practice time, there's no like set in stone thing that you have to do during your practice time. So don't feel like, oh, well she did this so I have to do that. No, just play. Okay, sometimes you just need to play. Um, so let's see, thank you Lord, King of Glory. And I'm like, King of
try those tips and let me know how you feel after you play for a little bit. Um, even just being on here doing a, a live with you guys and playing something that I already know really helps me feel like, oh, I practiced today or I played or I'm not feeling rusty because if you're not playing all week long and you're only playing on Sundays, by the time you get to Sunday, your fingers are going to feel a little bit rusty because part of your practice is your uh, muscle memory, remembering where the notes go, remembering how to play certain chords. Um, and so you want to make sure that you keep that up. Once again, if you do play for church or you know someone who does, background music is usually um, the time where you panic because it's like, what do I play? You know, when somebody's like, really wanting things hyped up and they're you know somebody's saying like oh let's all worship god are you glad did he you have a victory tonight and you're like i don't know what to play you know make sure you join that class because i'm going to give you guys some tips and show you things that you can do to fill in those moments how to be spontaneous when you're playing background music chords you can use and all that kind of stuff so the link is in my bio on Instagram and also on Facebook. If you give me a thumbs up, I will post a link. You do need to join before 12 p.m. Pacific because that's when the link goes out today. So if nobody's told you today, guys, know I believe in you. That's why I keep showing up every week. You have exactly what it takes to be an incredible musician. I hope you guys have a great day. I'll talk to you later. Bye.